you're watching 8-bit days a week I'm going for another Neo Geo game here so if you're not a fan of Neo Geo please check out my other videos instead but if you like fighting games or Neo Geo SNK games I'm now playing real about Fatal Fury 2 the newcomers all right Anyway, no need for that. Yeah, we got a lot of uh, characters here. I'm gonna go with Rick. She, pl I mean, he plays a lot like uh, Vanessa from KOF. Uh, I'm gonna go against the other new character, Shang Fei, who made a nice transition to the KOF series as well. I really like the animation on this game. I think this is the only game where uh, Rick Strode made an appearance though. Which is a uh, shame. Although we do have Vanessa, which is a staple, well almost a staple in uh, the KOF series. Trying to like do his super. I can't seem to. Actually, I may be doing it wrong. Anyway, forget, forget it. Oh, there it is. That was definitely not intended, but it worked well anyway. All right, we're finally in the pseudo 3D arena. And uh, once again, this did not make any appearance on uh, the PlayStation itself. In fact, I don't think it did on any um, home console. Oh wait, maybe the uh, like the collection on PlayStation Two, but not on the PlayStation One, definitely. I guess that's. Same goes for the my previous video, World of Heroes, there was also a collection on PlayStation 2, I believe. And once again, I can't seem to unleash the super. Anyway. The PlayStation did have like uh, um, it's exclusive to the PlayStation. It didn't. It wasn't on a Neo Geo or arcade. Um, it was uh, re real about dominated mind, and it's the one that featured Alfred, the guy that pilots the biplane. So it's, uh, at least it's something different, if you like that game, maybe I'll try it soon, if, um, if it's working on the PlayStation Classic though. One thing I do know about that game, it doesn't feature the, the pseudo tree 3D mechanic. Ah! Hey. Okay, 
given a bonus here. Let's go with uh, normal. But I'll choose someone else though. This time, Jin Chandre. Of course, uh, Jin Chandre here is the resident Shoto clone. You have your Fireball and Dragon Punch. And uh, sort of like a final flash for a super there. Whoa! I guess I was sort of predictable there. Now I do remember Joe being one of, has always been one of the tougher foes on even on previous uh, Fatal Fury games. Like he's definitely harder than to go against against a uh, Terry. Not so sure with Andy though. So I always I also have a hard time with Andy from time to time. theory is correct that um, Terry is easier than Joe. lost there. thing about the AI here is they're really good at using that uh, going in the background thing. Anyway, I think that should be it for this video. And this is real about Fatal Fury 2 when it's running great on the PlayStation Classic. In fact, I dare say if you don't have a Neo Geo Mini, this is a Actually, a better alternative. You know, unless if you have like the actual hardware, those things are very expensive. Alright, and you're watching 8 bit days a week. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.